guard gates up ahead, I do ask you to please not take any pictures of them or their posts for security reasons. Once we go through those gates, you'll be free to take pictures of anything else out there that catches your eye, even me. Now you might want to smile as you go through those gates. They do have cameras on their posts and they are- Sight and the launch today, incredible. This is over, go back through the gift shop and catch a bus over back over to the visitor center and it's going to drop you off right at the Atlantis. Go see the Atlantis. But please remember, 2.45 at the Rocket Garden, we have to leave for the ship at 3 o'clock. Thank you. Anybody have any questions, let me know before we leave. We will. So check it out. It's not that rough. It does give you vibrations, but it's not that rough. So Atlantis does take a good hour and a half. Yeah, it's a nice size one too. And the alligators are out today. We do have five to six thousand on property. Because it is a wildlife refuge. And it's also NASA's unpaid security system. And it works. Between 4 to 4.45, there is the astronaut of the day in the second floor of the space shop signing photos. And today that would be Bob Springer. Very nice man. So please go over there if you're here and want to meet him. And not to make a pun, but he is an astronaut that is very down to earth. So, he's a really nice guy. Go meet him. And he is in the second floor. And it's on your sheet. All of it's on your sheet, the times that you can get to see everything. Straight ahead, Rocket Garden. Play Dome is in that area also. Don't think we had any children on this bus, so. IMAX 3D, gray building with the blue trim around the top. And again, where the flags are flying is a memorial mirror. Straight ahead, Atlantis and her museum. Shuttle launch experience in there also. Other side of the space shop, astronaut encounter theater, that's on times too. I'd like to thank you for joining us.